A pair of two-time defending champions met at Southern Regional Wednesday night. The host had won the last two South Jersey Group 5 crowns, while Kingsway High School was a back-to-back -back champion in Group 4. As the night unfolded, it became more and more clear that the difference between the two schools was small, but it was definite. This is a frustrating one. They, they showed up and they out-wrestled us today. You know, time and again, we've done that to other teams this year. And for whatever reason, I, I didn't have these guys ready to go. We lost tonight and we could, we could go through them, whether it's 26, whether it's 38, whether it's, you know, I could, I could go, you know, 50. Um, they beat really good wrestlers from our team. Uh, and, and I'll tell you, like, kudos to them. They earned it tonight. Um, at the same time, I'll come back and ride my horses tomorrow, too. At 126, the Rams undefeated Wyatt Stout won a 4-3 decision over Kingsley's Nathan Taylor. A five-point move at 138 helped Matt Heinrich to an 8-2 decision over Joey Miranda. Southern won the first seven bouts and took a 22-0 lead before Kingsway's David DiPietro finally broke through at 157, and the Rams' Tyler Chase overcame a slow start with a big move at 165 to answer right back. I was thinking back to when uh, Eddie Hummel was with uh, Southern, uh, he committed to West Point. He taught me that headlock where uh, I had the cross face, um, and I just whipped it over like he taught me, and um, it just went through my head. I was right there, got it. Um, I mean, I didn't really get on his legs, but it was right there, so I just took it. Chase's win took on a bigger meaning after Kingsway took the next two bouts, including a technical fall by Dakota Morris at 175. With three bouts left, Southern needed just one win, and 215-pounder Riley O'Boyle took the simplest path. He won the next one. I did a head lever, and then I slipped my arm in, and I just grabbed his wrist, and I just ran it. Um, I was going to try to stick him, but he wasn't going. He was really strong up top. But yeah, I just three bouts was good enough for me. And three points were good enough for Southern. The Rams forfeited the last two weights and prevailed 28-23. They've won five of the last six South Jersey Group 5 titles awarded, but this one was special. It feels great. I mean, you know, we, we won it two years in a row, and then we couldn't compete last year in it. Yeah. And it kind of was a bummer for the, you know, for the kids, you know, because that's that's our goal every year to be here and to win it. And obviously, it's not going to happen all the time, but you want that's the goal that you want to have happen. And just not to compete last year, just it was it was harder to motivate them. Um, but this year being back and having the crowds, I mean, it's great. I mean, we had such a great crowd tonight, and it was, you know, I think I feel it was the biggest match in the state out of any of the matches tonight. You know, two great teams going at it, great wrestling. Each team had, had ranked guys in the state. You know, both, both teams had tough kids, and the crowd here was unbelievable. Our fans came and supported, and, you know, I couldn't ask for anything more. From Southern Regional High School in Manahawkin, this is John Lewis.